We are a dedicated team of hardcore outdoor enthusiasts committed to conserving hunting and fishing traditions. Although the technology changes, we still strive to cater to everyday outdoors. If you like fast-paced, hardcore southern hunting and fishing action, keep up with us and hold on. We are 704 Outdoors. Seven Hundred Four Outdoors TV show is brought to you by Barefoot Archery, North Carolina's leading archery dealer since 1966. Hey folks, Lee and Katie Howard here with Seven Hundred Four Outdoors. I've got a quick little hunt I want to share with you today. Hey y'all, this was my very first turkey season, and it was a very exciting hunt this particular morning that Lee and I were out. And I think you're going to enjoy watching me get my very first bird, and also see Lee get one too. Stay tuned and enjoy the episode.
There's all this talk around town about how great Hal's Pawn and Gun Shop is in Concord, North Carolina. People keep talking about all the different gun manufacturers they carry, like Glock, Springfield, Smith & Wesson, Remington Arms, and so many more. And I hear they have ammo, holsters, stocks and grips, and specialize in gun repairs, modifications, and custom builds. Plus they have any style of gun, whether it's for sport shooting, hunting guns, or tactical weapons. Hal's Pawn and Gun Shop, 595 Church Street North in Concord, North Carolina. Norris Merchandise is your one-stop shop destination. Need new furniture or to fix something up in your home? We have all the hardware you need and carry quality designer furniture like Lane Home Furnishings at rock bottom pricing. Going hunting? Get your ammo, knives, hunting apparel, and boots here. Looking to purchase a new bow? Let our highly trained archery technicians in our pro shop help you find exactly what you need. Norris Merchandise, where getting what you want is easy. 2011 South Lafayette Street in Shelby, North Carolina. Light up the night with sniper hog lights and take down some hogs. Our new all steel exterminator feeder light is solar powered to put out red light all night and keep the big hogs around. Reach out and touch a pig at 800 yards or more with our brand new models. And our mini sniper moves the competition away from your rifle or bow. Light up the night with sniper hog lights. Visit sniperhoglights.com to pick yours up and knock them down. Attention all hunters, looking for that perfect bow, crossbow, or archery accessory for your next hunt? Barefoot Archery in Charlotte has exactly what you need. Our professional and friendly staff can help you purchase the perfect bow and arrows for your hunting or target practice in our shop, and we'll teach you how to use it. Need practice? Check out our indoor archery range. New to archery? Moms, we offer archery classes for homeschool and after-school students, as well as private lessons. So no matter what level you're on, we'll get you on target at Barefoot Archery in Charlotte, located at 4410 Old Pieville Road in Charlotte. This segment is brought to you by Busted Arrow for all of your hunter's clothing and accessory needs. She told him. Hell yeah, baby. She, wait, 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 wait. Just wait. Give me some, baby. Oh my God. Give me some. Give me some right here. Oh my God. <laughs> Double. Hell yeah. Are you serious? I'm serious. Oh my God. <laughs> Go out there and check them out. I'm going to cry. <laughs> A dual turkey. Put the freaking hammer on them. I'm serious. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> I'm freaking double. How about that? I thought that thing was going to come out on my head. I mean, can it get any better than that? <laughs> huh? like, it's like pounding. Can it get any better than that? I mean, really. <laughs> Crazy. I'm so proud of you. Oh, I don't want to cry. <laughs> Check them out. Oh, that is insane. Look at them hooks on him, honey. Good lord. Pretty good sized beard. Oh Look my god. Hooks. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe up. this. I feel like I missed it. It happened so quick. I don't remember what happened. It's a pretty good sized bird right here, baby. Oh, I 
cannot believe they were right there. I know it. Where did they come from? I mean, it was they like... They come from behind us. It sounded like one was right there. Well, but I mean, like, they were back there, and then all of a sudden, it was like he was behind my tree. I know. Could you hear him spitting and yes. drumming? Yeah, I couldn't tell if that was my heartbeat or if it was him. <laughs> it was like... I could hear its feet crunching and moving. Oh, my God. Look at all the feathers. Look at the carnage. The feathers and the carnage. We can make a pillow. Sweet. I'm going to go back to bed. <laughs> Here she comes. <laughs> With her victory walk. <laughs> if I fall down, it's going to gouge my eyes out. <laughs> Get them, baby. Get them out of here. <laughs> painful. i got to stop. <laughs> I love you. Alright, bye. Mom said she was excited. She said she's going to make the um, sweet potato casserole. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Yep, that's right. Your prey just picked up your scent and he's gone. Not to mention, you've got your own unwanted company. So how do you stay close to your prey and keep the pest away? You need the brand that keeps your scent under wraps and repels ticks, chiggers, spiders, and lice. You need stealth. Stealth products are made with natural, non-hazardous ingredients, so you blend into your surroundings without alerting your prey. Whether you're on the marsh or in the field, you can hunt with confidence, knowing you have the advantage. Stealth. We've got your six. Get yours. Big Game Butter, whether it's for an attractive, for trail camera surveys, or for year-round deer nutrition. Big Game Butter gets it done. High in protein and fat, rain and mold resistant. Deer find it fast and come back often. Attention all hunters, looking for that perfect bow, crossbow, or archery accessory for your next hunt? Barefoot Archery in Charlotte has exactly what you need. Our professional and friendly staff can help you purchase the perfect bow and arrows for your hunting or target practice in our shop, and we'll teach you how to use it. Need practice? Check out our indoor archery range. New to archery? Moms, we offer archery classes for homeschool and after school students, as well as private lessons. So no matter what level you're on, we'll get you on target at Barefoot Archery in Charlotte, located at 4410 Old Pieville Road in Charlotte. When you're ready to break away from the same old, same old, when you're ready to stand out in the crowd, come to McPherson's Diamonds and Design. Each jewelry piece is hand-selected. We choose only the most compelling pieces from each designer, beyond what you could ever find at the mall. And for the most unique, owner and master jeweler Richard McPherson will custom design and create the perfect piece made just for you. You have a certain style and personality, and your jewelry should reflect that. McPherson's Diamonds and Design, an expression of you that shines. This segment is brought to you by Dawn to Dusk Outfitters, located in Anson County, North Carolina, specializing in whitetail deer and turkey hunting. One of the greatest things about hunting, period, is being able to go hunt with your son and enjoy the outdoors. And uh, he brought along a good friend of his with him. So it's got associated with this 704's outdoors. And uh, we had a good time that day. We went, uh, we actually went several places trying to get on a bird and had a pretty tough time. But, we finally got on this bird. He was a good bird, and uh, they did a great job of calling him in. All I had to do was sit down and squeeze the trigger, and, and it worked out great. All right, y'all, it's spring turkey season 2014. We're going to head up to Davie County this morning. Uh, me and my dad's going to be hunting. It's uh, So far, I think we're about three weeks into the season here. Been chasing birds as much as we can, and not with much luck. They're talking to us, they're wanting to come, but for some reason they're not really cooperating yet. But uh, watch this episode and I think you'll see that our luck turned around a little bit today. What's going on, Rumi? Uh, trying to get on these birds. Uh, we got two goblins. One of them's not far off right now. Uh, down here on the sewer line. So I think we're gonna set up right here in this, uh, this tree that fell down. Try to get one in here for my dad this morning. Um, he's lagging behind somewhere a little way, so I'm going to pop these decoys up and hopefully we'll get on one here shortly.
All right, we started out uh, started out this morning on uh, on one piece of property, chasing some birds, had some gobbles. Uh, nothing real big happened. Uh, turkey's getting locked down. It was about the third weekend of season here, and uh, we left first place, went to another big farm where there's there's always turkeys out in some cut cornfields. Chased them all morning and couldn't make anything happen there. There's a uh, there's a little piece of property my dad's got. We decided we'd go try it. Nobody had been on it up to this point in the season. It was, uh, Pretty long walk across big cow pasture. We got over there, had to cross two or three fences, and and uh, got over there to the woods where he was. Found him. We caught him around a hill. Uh, he was actually on top of a hill on the other end of the ridge. And uh, this bird was hot. He gobbled and gobbled. Uh, worked really well with us. We uh, we had him in front of us in no time. And old dad, he he put the smack down on him. About 35 yards, just blowed his noggin clean off just about. This segment is brought to you by D&K Skull Mounts, Skull Mount Specialist and home of the $30 Skull Mount. Across that creek, and, I, and he, he wanted to turn that one down. Oh Lord, <laughs> I didn't. I done seen what he had hanging. Yeah. That's the 
back and look good on film. Well, I appreciate it, y'all. I enjoyed it. Uh, I enjoyed it. And you know the best part of it? Got him on my place. Yeah. You see the lion run just right, in, right inside your middle of the line right there. Yeah. I actually catch it about 10 foot of that corner right there. The day is still early yet. We hunted hard this morning, had a close call. Uh, bird come in at about 90 yards, locked up, and he didn't like something. He left out of town and uh, came over here at this place on the neighbor's property and kind of trying to hunt some cow pastures. And didn't have anything gobbling and was starting to get a little discouraged. And we headed back over here toward my toward my dad's place and yelped one time and this guy lit up. So we more or less sprinted across the cow pasture, got down here in the creek bottom and got set up right quick and he gobbled 70 yards from us and in a matter of I don't know, it was, I'd say less than a minute and this bird was on top of us. And old Pops left a three and a half scream at him. He ain't got much head left, something wrong with him. He had a headache, I we cured it, he don't hurt no more. He's a big bird, that's for sure. Whew. Hang him on the fence. I'm beginning to think it's turkey hunting's a young man's game. <laughs> <laughs> Been doing it a lot of years, but I think it's catching up to me. Well, yeah. let's carry this joke right here and go get another. I was just going to tell about the first hunt that uh, Russell went with, the first turkey hunt, and uh, was hunting up in uh, Surrey, Allegheny County, up there in the mountains. And uh, I don't we was out there. It's pretty, pretty good day, pretty good morning. We seen several birds, and finally, uh, an old bird come in with side we wanted. Shot the bird, and uh, you know, Russell had his double barrel stopper gun with him. So he jumps up and runs down there. He's going to told him, I said, go down there and hold that bird, make sure he don't run off. Well, he runs off out there after his bird, after that bird, going to hold his gun on him. And about the time he got there on him, that bird got to fluttering and carrying on. And I'm going to tell you, if you ever seen a four-year-old make 90 mile an hour, he made it coming back to the blind. But uh, that's the kind of things that makes hunting what it is. And uh, keep it real, keep it fun, and, and uh, Make make the most of it. It was just a good trip. One a minute. This show was brought to you by Barefoot Archery, Sniper Hog Lights, Stealth Odorless Outdoors, Norris Merchandise, Big Game Butter and how's gun and palms.